there is a place of rural life and maritime heritage. The whole Chesapeake experience shapes this landscape. Where past stories of a land and its people were thought lost to time. It's absolutely astonishing how much of it still exists. And the present reveals a spirit of those whose lives depend upon the cultivated generosity of soil and sea. It's amazing still to see the cycles of things. Our family home is 300 years old, believe it or not. I represent the sixth generation farmer, and we love it here. Maryland's Kent County lies between the Sassafras and Chester Rivers on the eastern shore of the Chesapeake Bay. Its cultural landscape is a reflection of how people have managed and used its resources. People integrated into it, manipulated it, used it, and shaped it. And how that use, in turn, has shaped this land. It's really important to understand how this landscape evolved so that we can know how to think about it for the future. In an era of bending nature to our will, Kent's lands and waterscapes still appear as they did to indigenous people centuries ago. Footprints of English settlements are being revealed, and citizens are finding their stories from history nearly forgotten. I think it's important for us to remember the legacy that you know, we did have here, you know, that we still do have a stake here, and that we have something that we can build on here. This is Kent County's storied landscape from its first inhabitants to today.